Welcome back to the Krusty Krab, and today Mr. Krabs is going to be feeding you some more Krabby Patties. And by Krabby Patties, I mean some more Super Mario Galaxy 2 custom levels that you guys seem to enjoy a lot. So I'm really sorry that um, I haven't been uploading as many, and that isn't even because I'm lazy or anything. I've still been uploading videos every day, and sometimes more than one. This is my second video today. Um, but the thing is, sometimes I'll download a custom level and then I'll boot it up and it doesn't even work. And other times I can't even find any, and if I do, they don't even have a download link. So, yeah, but today we're going to be playing one called Cosmic Caverns Galaxy. And it is made by someone called Frogo, playing the Seaside Silver Stars first mission. And, um, yeah, I'm just going to be some more good old Luigi action for you guys. So, uh, looks this was pretty cool. I always enjoyed this music and actually put it in one of my Winifred videos uh, a while ago. Um, I think the one that was where Alistair tries to take a bath and everything and then fucking... Um, I think you guys, you guys just found that part funny. Okay. Am I sp okay, I'm just supposed to freaking... I'm just gonna just bonk myself down. That, that, that freaking works. Does we're running out of air, so I want to go back up here. I don't know. Okay, yeah. So since it's called Silver Stars, we're gonna be looking for five silver stars, as always. Okay, I'm just gonna ditch the freaking shell at this point, so I can actually dive. And okay, this one's kind of a weird spot. gonna try I can like maneuvering myself a little bit different okay there we go so yeah I guess I was just at a sort of a weird angle and everything but I hope there's okay yes yeah, so I was just gonna say I hope there is another shell over here so that um, I can grab it and I won't have to go back throughout the other uh, cavern, cavernous area. So this is kind of funny, this happens today, I don't know if this is relatable for you guys, this happens to me so much where I'll just randomly see freaking people that I know, who, I have no idea who they are, but somehow they know who I am. Um, they'll just walk up to me and like literally my, I was just walking, I was at my mailbox and this one random ass guy was like, yo, it's the cookster. Just like, who the hell is this dude? Like, if, usually when people just do that, I think they're just trying to annoy me or something, because unless they say, aren't you the freaking, like, dude from YouTube or something, then I know they're just trying to bother me. So, yeah, but this other guy, um, apparently he went to high school with me, that's what he said. And I've seen him before and everything. And, um, he basically, okay, I'm gonna get the fuck up there, okay, that trampoline is useless, I could just do this. Um, I don't even know why they put that there. But this guy supposedly said that he knew me from school, and, and I remember I walked in the, he works at the Panera Bread and everything in my town, and I walked there, and, um, I literally just had to take a shit, um, this first time, and I wasn't even buying food or anything, and, um, he basically just, uh, saw me and was like, hey, Mark Cook, he's like, who are you? <laughs> I was a little bit confused, because I was, oh, I don't know who this guy is, and, I, yeah, I just said, who are you, and everything, and he was, oh, I'm, 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 I am i i do not know, we're gonna give him a fake name, Harold, let's say his name's Harold, so he was, oh, I'm Harold, and everything, um, and uh, it was all Harold who? Harold Flower from fucking Spongebob? And he's like, no. Oh. But, um, let's read this tech. I was trying to grab the Silver Star when I dropped my ore. Um, but, yeah, this freaking Harold guy. Um, he had just, um, ended up saying, like, oh, we had biology and freshman year together. And I was just like, did we really? Um, freaking fascinating. Um, because I don't really remember you and everything. 
Oh, there's the next uh, silver star. We just need one more. I don't know if there's going to be any more in the chest or anything, but we'll see. We'll see what's on the ship. But um, then he just um, said, like, oh, yeah, we were and everything. And then he was just all, what brings you? Are you buying food? I can give you a discount. And I was like, no, I'm, I'm not actually. Um, I just had to take a fat shit. Um, I stuck? What the hell? Okay, I guess not. I thought it was stuck there for a second. Um, but he just said... Okay, one second. I've been told stories of a treasure beneath the water since I was a little boy. Um, but he just essentially told me, he's like, no... Um, if you're not buying food, then maybe I'll give you a freaking discount next time and everything. Um, so... I was thinking, okay... Cool, I guess. Um, but I hardly ever buy it from Panera Bread because honestly, their food freaking sucks, and I don't really care for it. Um, but yeah, basically, he just um, said, "Oh, okay, like have a nice day or whatever." Uh, but then the next time I came, in, which was today, um, he basically just uh, said hi to me again, and then. He was all, oh, your YouTube videos, I've been watching those, you're really funny and everything. I was, oh, thanks. Um, and he said, uh, just for making me laugh here, you have a drink on me and everything. So I was, wow, this is actually really nice. I didn't ever expect that making goofy videos online um, would get me freaking, like, free Sprite. And, like, I literally got a Sprite out of it. Um, see if there's anything over here, and I see this freaking, like, tree-type platform, I'm gonna see... Okay. Can definitely get up there. Okay, let's try a triple jump. Cause I don't even actually think that there's freaking anything. Okay, whatever. I don't even think there's anything on top of that other tree. Um, I'm just gonna go back into the water and um, I can look for that shell again. Cause there's there's a couple treasure chests that I want to unlock. I want to see if there is the comet metal or freaking um, something. Um, just to see if I can find anything. Maybe there's a hidden star somewhere. Okay, there's a one-up right there. He's having a seizure. Oh, go away anyway. Alright, I somehow got it. <laughs> I didn't think I could get it. But I somehow did. Okay, I wanna... I'm gonna see if I can blow up that other ship, because that sort of makes me think of that hidden star in the first Galaxy game, um, the Deep of Dark Galaxy. I want to turn my volume down real quick, it's kind of loud. I remember some people have been saying, like, why don't you freaking fix that in editing? I was like, dude. Uh, n no offense, Mr. Squidward, but I'm... Okay, there's nothing back here. But I just mean, like, no offense, Squidward, Mr. Squidward. I'm not gonna freaking do that just for two seconds or something. It's just a waste of time. If I mess up and accidentally say racial slur or something, I, mean, I just never have. I just think about it. It was just a stupid example. Okay. I think... That there's I think there might be Actually I'm starting to think you might have to find the um freaking other silver star on top of the tree. Cause I mean I don't know why they would put them there if you're not supposed to 
Oh yeah, that, that is where it is. So I was just thinking, yeah, they wouldn't put it there if you're not supposed to go there. Also, I'll leave the download link. Okay, there we go. We got up to it. I'll leave the download link if you want to play this level yourself in the description. Alright, conveniently, the star is just right over there, so we don't even have to go super far to get it. And that was supposed to be cool, and ground pound into it, but I didn't. Yahi, yaho, yahoo. One of the things that's cool is this actually um, gives you extra stars in a way, and it, so you can be one of those freaking hackers or whatever that has 243 stars. Okay, nobody cares to freaking suck a fat cock, please. Alright, maybe there is no comet metal, but I don't know. Am I actually supposed to find the golden shell somewhere? Maybe that'll be the second mission, we'll see. Snap block satellite. Alright, we're starting on the same planet again. Uh, maybe we're gonna be going to the other planet. Because I did see that other planets. Uh, is there anything in this hole? Maybe there is something in. I guess so. It was just. Um, <laughs> This takes you back to the other side, that's kind of stupid. Ah, I'm running out of air. Oh. Go down there, please. Luigi. Ah, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. <laughs> I was so close to that. Well, that was I just should not have taken that little secret cavern. That was stupid of me. I thought there was going to be some cool one there, but no. The other thing cool in there was death. Curiosity killed the skinny Italian plumber, I guess. I don't know. I guess we're bonking our way to where we're supposed to go then again. Okay, what, what is Luigi doing? Is he freaking humping the floor now? Okay, this time it actually seems that there is just star bits on top of that one. Okay, can I? No, oh, I didn't. I didn't even know you could do that. Just trying to see if you could break. And there's a key there. Okay, I almost fell off that. Um, but I didn't even know if you could actually break glass with a shell. I guess you just just never got the opportunity to. Take this key. It fell from the satellite. I've been told stories of treasure beneath the water since a little boy. I have Alzheimer's. I said that last mission. The, is that crab just stuck freaking like his textures in the water or in the sand or something? That's weird.
Okay, spanking. I still don't know where they put that trampoline there, because you can easily just do this. So, I don't know, maybe the developer thought it looked cool. I didn't even know that could happen. Freaking land a goomba in water, they drown. Okay, let's see where this takes me. Oh, that was the same one. I didn't mean to take this again. Steal your frickin' one-up. Um, okay, I'm gonna try to use the trees, because I saw a slingster on there. I want to see where that goes. Okay, ignore you, Mr. Slingster. Okay, I don't even know why that exists. That just takes you back to the boat. That's dumb. Uh, I just want to sort of explore and see everything this galaxy has to offer in a way, so before I um, go down that pipe over there, I want to um, use this shell and see what's inside of the... Okay, I want to see what's inside of the treasure chests that are littered about the ocean floor and everything. Okay, that one's just totally empty. <laughs> If the others are empty, then I don't even know why they exist. It's a little bit silly to do that. It's like if they gave you a McDonald's meal, and then you open it, and it's completely empty. So this is so f kind of funny. This one lady at McDonald's today when I went there, um, I called the store because I wanted to see if they were open um, to go inside, because a couple weeks ago I went there, and I had to walk through the drive through because I, I didn't know that um, they were going to be doing a uh, freaking drive through only. So I'd, I'd never walked through the drive through and I thought they could tell you they could just refuse service or something. But I guess they can't. Um, I just um, thought it would be weird. So I'd never done that before. Um, but no, they didn't care, but I mean, I called them up and everything, and I asked, um, I said, are you guys open for customers to walk inside and everything, and they had said, and then the guy goes like, oh, let me, um, just one second, and then he gives the phone to his co-worker for some reason, so then she takes it, and I ask her the same question, I said, like, I had went, came here yes a couple of weeks ago, and you guys were only open for drive through are you guys open for um, walking in? She went, okay? And I was like, what do you mean, okay? That was a question. Um, <laughs> what? I was just really confused. And I said, so are you guys open for people coming in? She's like, yeah, we are. I was like, oh, okay, cool. Oh, okay, this is... Where the common metal is. So yeah, this, this is interesting. Usually, I guess since developers, um, when they make their own custom levels, they have kind of free reign to do almost whatever they want, so... I guess... Okay, screw me. I guess that was kind of cool that they did that. They put the, um... Frickin'... They put the frickin' Comet Coin in the... I want to get this coin. Look at the comet coin in the second mission. I didn't even know you could do that. Okay, that's stupid. Um, it shouldn't have happened. And also, I would want to pause, but there have been times when I try 
It didn't even do anything. As I'll show you guys, I literally have it mapped to freaking like F4 and everything, like hotkeys and all that, like, um, or F7, I mean. Like, listen, I'm pressing F7 to pause it. It's not working, so I can't even pause it now. That freaking sucks. I just don't know what I did wrong. So I guess I'll have to do this part again, and I'll just, um, we can make a save state when I get to the last part for you, so if I die, then I won't have to do it all over again. But so far this galaxy has been pretty solid, I've enjoyed it. This part is really cool. It still just doesn't... It's kind of funny, we're just literally in like the answer matter void and everything. And it still literally has like the dun dun dun, like the relaxing ass music and everything. It's kind of funny, it just doesn't really fit. I just thought they could put um, different music there. Alright, so, uh, okay, we're going to make our sims a safe state. To make sure it works. Just because there have been times when I've made a safe state, it didn't even work. So, okay. Did not want that to happen. Somehow I survived that. to do that. I was trying to freaking use it um, somehow without getting hurt, but I guess it might not even be possible. But um, over here is my star. Somehow, again, I'm getting the same stupid ass letter. I don't even know why. I don't care, Toad. Uh, but let me see. I want to check and see if there's any secret stars in this level. Yes, there is. So I'm guessing it's going to be in the first mission. And yes, and we have to find the golden shell. I'm gonna sort of get take a wild guess, because um, otherwise I pretty much explore the whole planet. And if I can't find it, I'll just um, just end off the video. But I just want to. I'm gonna see if it's in that little that little like freaking cavern hole. Can I go in this one too? Okay, I guess I can't go in that, but I wasted some of my ears spinning, so I'm gonna go back the way I came real quick just to freaking not suffocate Loogie. Okay, so I guess I can't go in that little, other than look like a hole, maybe I can... Go in the other cavern for that little hole thingy because maybe that's just decoration. But I do want to see if there's actually anything in here. Because last mission there wasn't. And this mission there isn't. So.
so um, I'm gonna go back to the um, other the base planet area and if I can't find the fucking golden shell then I'm just gonna not play it because I don't want to spend all day here doing that Because I literally checked everywhere that it could be in this ocean floor. I checked every chest. I checked every everything above here. I'm pretty sure I did. Yeah, I don't know if I can even get to that planet at all. Um, so I don't know if there's anything. Just doing this boat or anything at all, really. So, uh, seems as though I can't actually find where, I'm, where the freaking golden shell is. But other than that, this level is a lot of fun. So, um, thank you guys very much for watching this episode of Super Mario Galaxy 2 Custom Levels. And I will see you guys next time.